driving home from work yesterday and I'm not in the best mood and I decide you know what I know how to shape this you can't be in a bad mood while praising and worshiping so I put on my music and I'm praying to God I'm worshiping having a great time and I'm in Florida and it's summertime so that means it's gonna rain it's hurricane season right now and it rains every day I don't mind the rain but I don't like driving in it especially when it's like a lot of rain so I'm driving and as the rain starts falling at first it's a few drops here and there and then it's just full-on storm people in front of me are putting on their hazards because we're on the freeway and you know you got to drive as safely and as slowly as possible in a storm like this right what I'm used to doing is getting super quiet and focusing on the road while I'm driving in a storm so I stop praying stop worshiping I turn my music completely off it's just me the rain just driving and I hear a voice and the voice says but why'd you stop praying why'd you stop worshiping and I think for a second and I say out loud yeah why did I and I got to thinking I was praising and worshiping when the sun was shining and I was you know driving along but the second the storm came I focused on the storm and I stopped praying and I stopped worshiping I turned the music off I got completely silent so then I went back to what I was doing I turned my music back up I went back to praying and worshiping and before I knew it I wasn't focused on the rain anymore I wasn't focused on the storm I was focused on God I was focused on the one who could get me through the storm and before I knew it of course I made it home safely out of the rain and everything but the revelation I got was that's exactly what I tend to do during life storms during those hard times during those tests I kind of just clam up and I get real quiet and I'm in my head and I continue to focus on the problem to focus on the thing that's bothering me instead of doing what I'm supposed to do instead of praising God and worshiping him through the storm because he's the one that's going to get me through the storm does that make sense I had to get on here and share this revelation with you just because it was it's like it's common sense I feel like it's supposed to be common sense but for me even as a Christian it's like some things don't really come to me so quickly because I feel like I have to get everything figured out like on my way home I'm feeling like I'm the one that has to get me home I'm the one that has to focus on the road get me home safely out of the storm just like the storms of life I feel like okay I need to figure this out what am I gonna do to get out of the situation get out of this problem and really I'm supposed to just rest in God I'm supposed to focus on God so I hope that this message helps somebody today so just that's that's it that's the lesson so the next time you're in Uh, one of life storms you're in an actual storm whatever the case may be before you start worrying or even if you've already started worrying stop and immediately focus on God put on your favorite worship song just or, or if you don't have music around just start singing to God just give it to God just start praising him just go into prayer and just thank him thank him for getting you out of the storm you're still in the storm doesn't matter thank him for getting you out of the storm And before you know it, you'll be out in the storm.